other reporting that suggests that administration officials, <coughs> including Secretary Granholm, Vilsack, and Blinken, met last night to discuss uh, rising fuel prices. I was wondering if, if you could confirm those names and also what are the options that they were uh, discussing? Well, we are very well aware um, for a range of issues, and we should talk about those, uh, that um, the American people are, of course, impacted by uh, rising prices of gas in some parts of the country, not all. What? Uh, and also uh, looking ahead to the winter season and looking at um, uh, natural gas uh, supply out there. Maybe they don't look at it exactly through that prism, but I would say we do. Tonight, gas prices are soaring with little end in sight. Americans are spending $430 million more every day on gasoline than just one year ago today. But it's not just fueling your car. Experts say heating your home this winter could be cost. Megan, when can we expect prices to come back down? Well, Jose, energy experts say it could take months. It depends on demand. So, for example, if more people are commuting to work and we have a bad winter, we could see these elevated prices well into next year. Uh, rising prices of gas in some parts of the country, not all. You! You liar! How do you sleep at night? <laughs> Man, you are one pathetic loser. <laughs> no offense. You can hear the chants from the, the crowd. Let's go, Brandon.